Good evening. Iowa says it is out on new COVID rules for large employers. Friday night, the state's labor commissioner announced the state would not uphold OSHA regulations. KCCI's Andrew Mullenbeck looks into what that means for businesses in Iowa. The new OSHA regulations are to apply to employers with at least 100 employees, but Iowa has given notice it will not be adopting or enforcing those rules about vaccine requirements or weekly testing. The future of these rules is now in the hands of the Supreme Court, which heard oral arguments on the mandate Friday. Employers were supposed to comply with the vaccination or testing requirement by January 10th. Drake University professor Denise Hill says it's a bit of a wait and see for now. The significance of this is going to depend on where the court comes down in terms of um, the stay that was originally put in place until December 18th and then lifted by the Sixth Circuit um, for enforcement. In a statement released Friday night, Labor Commissioner Rod Roberts said, in part, Iowa has determined that it will not adopt the federal standard. Iowa has concluded that it is not necessary because Iowa's existing standards are at least as effective as the federal standard change. Governor Reynolds' statement accused the Biden administration of preferring to dictate health care decisions and eliminate personal choice, causing businesses and employees to suffer and exacerbating the workforce shortage. For now, Hill recommends that large employers plan to follow the OSHA rules. I think that all employers should be um, having a plan in place and, and moving forward with the expectation that this could very well go forward. We don't even know what the court will do for sure. And, um, and regardless of the state's willingness to enforce it, if the federal government takes the position that um, Iowa's plan is not sufficient in this area, they do have the option of enforcing it themselves. In Des Moines, Andrew Mullenbeck, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.